What is up, my crazy bit of Vodacoons? My name is Vodaco, you can call me V, and it's currently 20 to 1 in the morning, so I'm wide awake. <laughs> Hope you're all having a good day. I'm having a pretty good I mean, it's, you know, started 40 minutes ago, but I'm having a pretty good day so far. <laughs> what we're we'll doing today's episode is basically just messing around in the battle stage in Infinite, hoping to get a legendary pack. I know I'm being very, 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 very hopeful right there, but we'll give it a crack anyway. We'll also start um, sort of trying to get our hybrids, well, hybrids, what am I on about? VIP creatures sort of out and leveled up, I'm sure. Pterodactylus, we've got a level 30, so we, we can't really place this guy yet. It won't be much, too much of a purpose. We could put one of these dudes down, get him to level 20. Uh, this guy, we could get level 30 and then some uh, Metaposaurus, mm, level 20. Tango, uh, one, two, okay. level 20. <laughs> Presto, level 20. Uh, quite a common theme going on there. We've also got the aquatics, which we can get up. Um, hey, no, we've got level 30, so if we need three more, then we've got level 40, which would be absolutely awesome. And I have a really confident feeling we might get our first VIP creature to level 40 this weekend when we open 100,000 VIP point gold, uh, where the solid gold packs, which is about 20. Oh, no, it's about 20 plus the additional one, two. 22 solid gold packs in one video. Let that sink in. <laughs> if we can actually get 23, if we can get up to 102,000, I believe. Uh, so that should be all right, actually. That would be, you know, that'd be really fun. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. Um, what we'll go ahead and do is, oh, we've got, just got a new trade literally just come in. Oh, literally crap. <laughs> this one I ain't doing because I want my VAP points, regardless of the fact that could give me loads more bucks. The fact I've got 64,000, and I, I, I see it like I've got 6,000. I'm really stingy with it. It's weird. It's such a weird concept that I've got that many, and I'm still like, I don't know how to spend it. But it's okay, guys. We will eventually. I'm sure. When the next tournament comes out. We've got the, um, what do you want to flip? The Salamander, uh, what do you call it? Salamander. The, 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 Salam, Salamander. 16, not 13, good lord. Uh, I think I put 13 in my previous description. Oh crap, I have to edit that now. Um, <laughs> but we've got Salamander 16 to deal with, and that's what we're prepping for in this video. Uh, we're looking to sort of um, do these battle stage, see if we can get any more VIP points ready so that we can get some pterosaurs up and ready, hopefully getting us a max pterodactylus or a decent level pterodostro to take on the Salamander and really whip its buttocks into shape. So, obviously our most powerful creature at the moment is a carnivore that's well, our first and third most powerful creatures of carnivore second most powerful is a pterosaur so it's all good there but we do have to deal with that anyway let's go ahead and load this up so weirdo can probably get in there like, then we need a carnivore we can probably have you and then we need an amphibian which we could have mm, those are too weak we will need to buy one of them back so mastodon right before we go ahead and do that though what we'll go ahead and do is we'll go ahead and have a race so if you haven't raced me before oh actually i need to find something to uh to level up, what could we level up? Um, oh, where's the Unirinka? There you are. We'll go ahead and get this guy to level um, level two, level twenty. Actually, we can possibly get level thirty out of this. I didn't even think about that. So what we'll do is going to go ahead and get this guy to level um, ten by default. Then we'll move on to the next one. So if you've been racing before, what you need to do is you need to be in full screen, exit full screen, and like the video and the time it takes me to get this guy to level six. Now, uh, no, 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 level seven, level seven. So by the time it takes me to get this guy to level 7, you need to be in full screen. So you need to have entered full screen after not being in it in the first place. No, wait, my god. You need to be in full screen. Exit full screen. Like the video. Re-enter full screen. If you beat me, you can comment down below with a unique and random insult aimed at myself. And if I beat you, you let me know. I won't insult you. I'll probably just brag a little bit. So on the count of three, we'll get this started. Three, two, one, go. I think I just put all my energy in getting to level 7. It, it, it took a lot. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get this guy to um in here. We probably want to speed up. We'll give it one speed up. No, no, we've got the bucks for it. We've got the bucks for it. We can do this. <laughs> uh, it's not super useful at the moment, but having a level 30 Unorincus is pretty cool. I freaking love this thing. It reminds me of a sort of a derped up terror bird, but I know it doesn't sort of... It's more like a terror ostrich. <laughs> if you really want to go into semantics. Oh, my poor food. My poor food levels. Oh, God. Evolve again. What does it look like? Mm, not much difference. It's a bit more colour to it. 162 bucks. Oh, that hurt. We'll just do it. We'll uh, not speed up anymore. We'll just put it in here now and sort of leave it so when I can get up, I can sort of probably speed it up for uh, 77 bucks, hopefully, leading us to a nice even number. Let's go ahead and win this common pack now, then. So we've got ourselves Weirdo. Then we need Trudon. Then we need Mastodon. I think we should be able to deal with this pretty simple, like. 
989. Mm -hmm. And the fact is, I've got so many bucks, I can skip up. Um, skip the um, battles, waiting for the battles. Okay, I'm not going to make a profit. In fact, I'll make a massive, massive, massive loss. But it's a loss worth having, considering I can get VIP points and DNA from it. <laughs> uh, we'll go ahead and go for two reserves, one block. Keep him the one block in there just in case he get, gets uh, doesn't do anything and gets it safe for three, but he doesn't. It's all good. Uh, he doesn't go for anything once again, kind of panicking. Uh, we'll switch into Mastodon at this point. Uh, can't really much take from Terra, Terra Destroyer, so we'll go for two blocks, two reserves. In case he's gone for reserves, he has. He's gone for two. Oh my god. That is not good. Hopefully, he only goes for three instead of four. Oh, he doesn't go for any. That's all good. I think at this point, Mastodon's kind of, you know, pointless anyway, because um, we've got sort of Trudon that can get rid of Carnaraptor. Um, if you can hear some rubbing, I do apologise. That was me itching my foot with the charging point for the laptop. So, you know, health and safety and whatnot. <laughs> right, he whipped me up into shape right there. Good lord, that was a horrific scene. Let's go ahead and switch into Weirdo. We should probably take care of him in two attacks, actually. I wasn't paying attention if he has any blocks, so this should be good. Uh, one, two, three... Four. Why not? Why not? There we go. He didn't have any blocks. That's great. Uh, I like how the Terra Destroyer sort of like how much of an underbite he really has. Like he protects his whole freaking skull with his teeth alone. Well, not teeth, but you know what I mean. It's freaking crazy. Uh, four. He'd need to go for four. Uh, uh, okay. He'd need to go for two. Yeah, so land three. But he doesn't. He doesn't do anything. It's all good. What I might do here then. So I might do a bit of a goading. I like goading him into attacking. So I'll go for four attacks, four reserves. He's I've actually done some decent damage there, actually. Probably, what, 1,300, 1,400? I wasn't paying attention. 1,300. Sweet. He's got up to six, though. He can kill me if he goes for a flat-out six. But leaves himself entirely exposed, which is going to cock up for him a little bit. So I can kill him for two. Just clarifying. Two blocks, four reserves. Next turn, regardless what he does... He is deader than the Dodo itself, unless he has a lot higher attack than I remember. He does not. The Parasaurus, decent health. It's actually a really good super rare herbivore um, in regards to health and attack combo. I don't think it's the best super rare. I think Giganocephalus might be a bit better than that, but it's still not bad. It's still not bad. Let's go ahead and take out the Parasaur here. Uh, speed this up because no one needs to see that. If it's a super rare or a legendary, it's worth the speed up. I'm going to do it anyway, regardless what it is, but it's worth it. However, I know my luck. It's probably an Infinity Pack, because or Mystery Pack, whatever you call them. I keep calling them Infinity Packs, because I, I know my luck. Oh, that's not bad. 500 DNA. It's really not that bad, considering how much I've sort of neutered my DNA. 65 VIP points. Every little helps. Uh, it's a common. <laughs> what the frickity frack. That's not cool. Um, wasting even more bucks. Or not wasting. Using, I should say. I'm not wasting them if I'm, you know, sort of making good use of. Pterodactylus. Um, you know, Terra Destroyer would have come in really handy at this point, but, you know, it's all good. And then, of course, uh, Ardemorphodon. So I'll go ahead and speed up. I swear, it was, was it really 1 million coins each time? I'm not 100% on that. We'll go ahead and do his sticker reserve down. Because even if he switches out, he, which he can do, uh, they're not going to do as much attack. Oh, he doesn't. He actually goes for an attack. Fair play to him. <laughs> um, I think he's done that because he knows I have to go for 3 to kill him anyway, and he sort of goaded me into doing it, which, you know, fair enough. I'm going to. <laughs> Um, we can get rid of the Raja Stega, which, you know, is pretty OP. Not that the Presto isn't fucking OP as well, but, you know, just saying. Um, right. Fantastic. Brilliant. 10 out of 10 would do again. Um, you know what? We could survive. Oh, you know, three, as he can. So we'll go for one block, two reserves. That way, uh, it's about to say, in case he's gone for reserve here, but he hasn't. He's gone for a block, so it's all good. Come on, do something, you pussy. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say, you pussy. And he does, so he's not. I take it back, my friend. We'll go for two attacks, four reserves. Regardless of what happens next, he's dead to the Demorphodon. Simple, really. You know, it doesn't matter what he does. He can go for one attack, leave himself with three blocks. He ain't gonna survive five attacks. He could go full out, screwed himself entirely. Down to him. No, he goes for all but one. Probably taking one little dignity block so that he doesn't, you know, sort of get smashed by eight attacks, which I can respect. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go ahead and go for a flat out eight here. And there's the little dignity block to speed that up. Completely unnecessary to watch. And speed that up. Completely unnecessary to watch. Let's go ahead and hopefully get bucks this time. I wouldn't mind sort of not losing as much, so it'd be nice. Oh, there we go, 100 bucks. A completely useless common. And 65 VIP points. Slowly but surely getting closer to 94,000. Can't tell what that is. I love not being able to tell what it is. Not. So, doesn't tell what it is. I literally am going into this blind, and I think I'll do this as my last one because it's, I'm literally going in blind. 
we'll need another um, amphibian. We'll go with Mastodon because, of course, it's cheaper. Uh, we need a Carnivore that's not that expensive. So Indominus is not as expensive as the other one, uh, although he's pretty freaking OP. And then we'll just go for Pterodactylus because we can. Um, not going to lie, the Unae or Unaea Rinkus is freaking crazy by the looks of it. We're going to go for one reserve just because, of course, he's probably going to switch into either Unae. No, he doesn't. He goes for a two. Oh, no, not the goading again. He's goading me again, but it's successful. So I'm going to go for three. One, two. Okay, yeah. <laughs> to make sure it will kill him, I was like, wait, is it not going to kill him? And I was working it all out wrong. I was like, oh, it, it will kill him. It's all good. Uh... In a Rinkus. Oh, wow. 1100 damage. And that's not even level 40. It'll probably hit about 1200, I reckon, at to level 40. And then plus a bonus, it'd be 1800 against the Pterosaur. Which even the VIPs won't last, what, two or three hits? So, you know, it's pretty crazy still. One block, two reserves. Because I know he's going to switch in from the um the old uh, Unahei Rinkus into the Oster. He doesn't. Are you kidding me? Right. I think the one block glitch is going to come in very. Very nice in a minute. Um, one block. <laughs> in fact, no two blocks apparently. Uh, let's see what he does this time. Has he gone for anything? He's not even gone for anything. So hopefully at this point then, he makes a move. He kind of does. Right, I reckon he's probably gone for one block than two reserves. So under that assumption, how much kills him? Three, four. Uh, you know what? Four attacks, four reserves. Oh, crap. Right. Because I've not gone for a block, which I was about to quit from then, but my phone didn't work, so I can't... Oh my god, right, we are literally... Of course. Uh, if he kills me, I'll be very angry. I'll be very angry. Thank god he didn't. I'm like, well, of course he knew that instantly that I can't... He will kill me if he does this, but he doesn't, so it's all good. Three attacks, four reserves, one block. Regardless what happens now, he is dead in the next turn. <laughs> I think we're getting a pattern slash theme going on. Um... Right, how much have I spent on this? Like 500 for the actual purchases, um, for the actual buying of the uh, events themselves. Uh, plus about 500, I'd say. No, it's more than 500, about 560, just over, you know, about 570 actually. Plus the purchase back of each creature probably. So I feel about, about a thousand bucks. So this is um, not viable in long term. Could do about 60 times, you know, so. <laughs> so that's you know, 120 packs, regardless of what type they are. That's still 120 packs. Um, let's have a look. What are we looking at here? Come on, give me something good. Yes, it was a freaking legendary! Oh my god, that's crazy! I love the fact he didn't tell me as well. I was like, what is it? I don't know. It's a legendary. Of course it is. Five... Oh my god. I'm like, oh, it cost us a hundred... A thousand bucks. Ask and ye shall receive. Gets a thousand bucks back. And 650. Taking it to 94,300. And it's an infinite uh, mystery pack again. So... It's all good. What comes around goes around. Absolutely no fears there, though. Absolutely incredible payback right there. Really happy with that. We've got any more sort of deals we can quickly pop over in and have a look at? No, of course we don't. So <laughs> good. It's all good, guys. If you enjoyed today's video, please smash the like button. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe and join my crazy blue video. I'd super appreciate it. My name's Vertical. You can call me B. Have a nice day and hurrah!